There are, of course, many reasons why Iceland has recovered earlier and more effectively than any other European economy that suffered from the financial crisis. But there are two fundamental dimensions to how we did it differently from others. The first is that we did not follow the prevailing orthodoxies of the Western financial world, the so-called Washington Consensus of the last 30 years. We, for example, let the private banks fail. And I have never understood why the banks are somehow treated like the holy churches of the modern economies and are not allowed to fail. Secondly, we did not introduce uh, the similar kind of austerity measures that have been almost mandatory in many other countries. We tried to protect the health service, the educational service, the welfare of those with uh, the least income uh, in our country. We introduced capital controls and uh, we let the, uh, the currency, we let the currency de devalue. And we did many other things that uh, were not uh, deemed to be orthodox within the uh, prevailing recommendations uh, in the last 30 years. But the second dimension is that we were fortunate somehow to realize early on that this was not just a financial crisis. This was also for the first time in modern memory a profound political, democratic, social, and even a judicial crisis. And unless you introduced reforms on all these levels, as well as the right economic policies, you would never be able to galvanize the nation to move forward. And many people tend to forget that an economy is not just a set of associations between financial institutions and companies and so on. An economy is fundamentally a community of people. And unless the people feel competent and have a vision and the will to move forward, it doesn't matter what kind of policies you try to implement, you will never be able to, uh, you will never be able to succeed. And these two dimensions are, in my opinion, one of the reasons why, despite there are still difficulties, of course, this, why Iceland uh, is now in a better position than anybody, including us, could have expected uh, four or five years ago.